The capital bond funds facility construction and or facility renovations. Specifically, funds are to make major repairs, replacements, and upgrades to improve safety, security, and update schools. This funding will help keep our schools maintained while providing equitable access to safe and modern learning environments. The capital bond covers the cost of safety and facility improvements not covered by state and federal funds. This bond will support health and safety projects, including a security vestibule access at our school. This will support a safer entry into our school buildings and provide an additional measure of safety. Our security cameras. So we wanna be able to have eyes everywhere on kids on campus, as well as anyone who comes to be a visitor here. And some of our cameras have blind spots. So having that updated, that security would be a great way to increase safety here. Some of the things that the schools will be getting that, that people may not talk about but are super important is working on our HVAC systems so that we have heat when we need it and we have cool air. Uh, I know at our school we have some older systems and so that's something that will happen at our school that keeps our kids warm in the winter and cool in the summer and so we really appreciate that that's something that will be done for our schools. We also have general maintenance that's going to happen with HVAC repairs, sidewalk repairs, lighting improvements. Again, all about ensuring that we have a safe campus for our students and a strong learning environment. It's also things like camera upgrades so we can better monitor our campuses to keep our students safe. Things like license plate readers so we know who is on our campuses. And um, again, with the intent being that we can help keep all of our students safe in their learning environments. Outdoor learning spaces are vital to student education. Safe and well-functioning surfaces for the districts, middle and high schools are necessary for both student athletics, activities, and outdoor classrooms. Inclusive playgrounds promote social interaction between children of diverse backgrounds, abilities, and skills and offer access to a sensory-rich environment to promote learning. One component of district-wide program growth is furniture replacement to support our students. Some furniture in our schools is over 30 years old. The 2023 bond will fund new ergonomic furniture that will meet the needs of how students learn today. The 2023 bond funds will be used to create early learning space in every Kent School District Elementary School. These funds will be used to increase equitable access to early learning opportunities for children at their local neighborhood school. Statistics have shown that early learning helps ensure a successful start to the K-12 experience. Technology infrastructure will equip our buildings with the necessary technology to support modern classroom teaching practices. This is important to student learning and what our goals are all about to support students. Another important item that would be covered in the 2023 bond is a new visitor management system in every school. The 2023 bond will raise $495 million to provide health and safety upgrades and fund critical improvements across the district. School districts cannot use bond dollars for teacher salaries or classroom operations. And most importantly, Overall local school tax rates are projected to drop by 8%. This tax information graph represents a good faith projection of future local excess tax rates in KSD. But projections involve important assumptions that can change. If you'd like to learn more about school tax rate projections, please contact us at 253-373-7164. It is important that everyone 18 years and older votes by April 25th. Please visit the Kent School District website for more information.